important to remember that uh, the best, quickest way to feel better is to get out of our own heads. And once we're able to get out of our own heads, once we're able to start becoming more uh, free, more mindful, and more aware of our surroundings, at the same time being aware but being and being present and not letting outside distractions get in your way, get in our way of the stuff that we want to achieve in our lives and our goals and, and our aspirations in life. When we're able to stop worrying about what other people think and uh, when we stop paying so much attention to what's uh, the, our past reality, when we're able to start creating a new reality for ourselves with what we want to do and what really drives and pushes us to get up in the morning, when we're able to start becoming more uh, you know, passionate and more caring and then opening our mind and our heart up to the universe around us, it's a great feeling. When we're able to start getting more grateful, when we're able to start having more gratitude, and that's when we're able to grow more, and we're able to start doing that stuff, and we're able to start bringing, able to bring our self our mind awareness back down to earth when we get stressed out. And we're able to start being more consciously aware, and we're able to start blocking out those negative thoughts, those negative feelings, those negative emotions. When we're able to start doing that, that's when we're able to start really enjoying life. That's when life's going to become more abundant. When we get less insecure, less insecure about ourselves and the way uh, um, our lives are, are at the present moment. Because when you're able to start becoming more greater than your current circumstances and your past circumstances, then you're going to be able to start growing tremendously in life and you're going to reach your goals. The bit, main thing is to follow through, you know, you follow through on your goals, follow through on, you know, changing the way you think and feel. For me, for years, I had a lot of anger and hatred built up into me. Now I'm not, I don't have that stuff because of practice and manifesting mindfulness and um, that's why I do these videos because I want more people to learn and to see how you can start to do it and um, that's why I'm going to start doing more of a learning thing to this. It's very important that more people find out and learn about how to manifest mindfulness, how to get out of your own head, how to sit next to someone that used to be your enemy and uh, not not your, so much an enemy, even like you know, someone you had past problems with, to be able to go in the same room and not have a conflict with them, to be able to put your past you know uh, problems that you had on you know in the past and to leave it there that's when you're gonna be you're gonna be start become so much more happier and transparent and more vibrant in life and you're gonna attract better things into your life as soon as you start doing that because when we're thinking about other people and worrying about ourselves and others that brings us down and it makes us feel sad and lack and when we're able to get out of our own heads that's when the joy for life comes we're able to stop worrying about ourselves and worrying about other people and embracing the positivity of life. And that's when life gets abundant and happy. And um, please subscribe. Hope you have a great day.